Institute for NGO Research. The floor is yours. Thank you, Madam Vice President. High Commissioner Bachelet did the right thing in delaying the publication of the Council's BDS blacklist, enacted as yet another way for the Palestinian Authority to exploit UN frameworks for legal and economic warfare. The production of this blacklist has been marred by irredeemable due process failures and anti-Semitic discrimination. The company names already leaked in the media are truly astounding. The vast majority are involved in providing for basic needs and civilian goods and services to Palestinians and Israelis alike. Egregiously, and based upon crackpot theories provided to them by BDS groups, many of whom are in this room, OHCHR has singled out pharmaceutical companies that have no presence in the West Bank. Many companies provide civilian protection from ongoing Palestinian terrorism. Other companies are engaged in activities mandated by the Oslo Accords and other international agreements, and some even have contracts with the PA to carry out the very functions upon OHCHR wants to blacklist them. Outrageously, companies that promote Jewish and Christian history are uniquely targeted, evidencing the discriminatory foundation of this entire exercise. Madam Vice President, at this very moment, hundreds are demonstrating outside, without sabotaging the UN fence, without launching balloon bombs, and without firing rockets onto UN property to protest this BDS blacklist and the rest of the grotesque anti-Israel spectacle taking place at the Council today. We are here to tell you enough is enough. Thank you. And I now give the floor to Human Rights.